Hey, what's up out there, everybody? Uh, sorry I haven't been around in so long, but uh, it's been really busy with the holidays and New Year's and stuff. I've worked like 30 hours in the past three days, so finding time to make a vid's been rough, but I figured today's the perfect opportunity because I got uh, something in the mail that I ordered, and I picked up a couple other things today. Um, this is start with what I ordered in the mail. This is not a movie that I didn't own already, but in addition that I didn't have. Uh, it's a Lucio Fulci's Zombie or Zombie 2. Um, if you don't know anything about this film, it the reason it's called Zombie 2 is because uh, the people that paid to have the movie made, uh, the Italian producers and stuff, uh, they wanted to cash in on the success of Dawn of the Dead, the original. And in... Uh, Italy and overseas in Europe, uh, Dawn of the Dead is known as Zombie. So they called this film Zombie 2. Uh, if you watch any of the special features or anything, they say clearly that they were not trying to make a sequel, but uh, it just it so closely resembled Dawn of the Dead and, and you know the way the movie and story is told and everything. Uh, they decided to call it Zombie 2. But uh, a lot of people consider this Fulci's masterpiece. It's one of my favorite Fulci films. I think my absolute favorite is probably The Beyond. I really like that movie. There's a close-up of the cover if you can see it there. Uh, it's got like a nice, like almost foil there. Everything, all the lettering's raised. The back of it's got the iconic zombie on there. And what's really cool is the DVD case looks different. It's got a different cover there to it. And, uh, the back. This is a two-disc. Has a nice. Uh, poster in it. It's a small poster, but it's the Italian poster. But I uh, got this pretty cheap on uh, Best Buy's website. They had it on sale, and on top of that I had a rewards bonus card, so got it fairly cheap. And uh, got that one in the mail today, so that's awesome. But, uh, the next one I picked up, uh, I got this today. I got this for eight bucks. I've been wanting to see this movie for a long time. It's been recommended to me by several people, but it's uh, one of Guillermo del Toro's uh, early films, The Devil's Backbone, and uh, it's it's got a similar story as far as uh, what's going on to um, The Sixth Sense, but it takes place uh, during the, the last days of the Spanish Civil War is what it says. I'm not sure quite what time period that is, but I guess I'll find out when I watch the movie, but the movie looks really creepy and really interesting. Maybe I'll do a review whenever I get finished watching this. Uh, it's got some stuff on it. It's got uh, the director and cinematographer commentary. It has a making of featurette, storyboard comparisons, theatrical trailers, and looks like that's about it. But uh, looks like a cool little movie. So I'll be watching that soon. Um, and then this one here, I already had this film. Same as uh, Zombie, but I didn't have this edition. Uh, for some reason, I didn't get it when it came out, and uh, now it's become kind of hard to find. Not too hard to find, but a little hard to find. Uh, I found this used. It's the uh, two-disc edition to The Green Mile. Uh, love this movie. Love Frank Darabont. I think the only one of his movies I haven't seen is uh, <clears throat> The Majestic with Jim Carrey, but I might check it out eventually someday. just haven't gotten around to it. But this thing is packed with special features. It is great. It's got a, a commentary by your... Writer-director Frank Darabont's got additional scenes. Uh, Walking the Mile, making of the Green Mile documentary. I'm not sure how long any of this stuff is. I haven't watched any of it yet. But, uh, yeah, uh, Miracles and Mystery, Creating the Green Mile, a six-part documentary uh, gallery with uh, things about Stephen King, the art of adaptation, acting on the mile, designing the mile, the magic of the mile, and the tale of Mr. Jingles. There's uh, also Tom Hanks makeup tests and Michael Clark Duncan uh, screen test and something called the teaser trailer, a case study, so whatever that is. But really love the artwork on the cover. Uh, that's the movie poster. I can't remember the guy's name that uh, draws those, but he always does uh, great movie poster art. But uh, that's, uh, that's this DVD update in a nutshell. Uh, also, I want to say thanks. Uh, to all my subscribers and all my viewers and friends and stuff, uh, there's been uh, several people that's been giving me shout outs and stuff over the past month or so. Uh, and Movie Music 007, shout out to him. If, uh, if any of my other subscribers don't know 
who he is and uh, don't uh, subscribe to him. Check him out. He makes cool vids. He's uh, a great taste in flicks. Uh, also, uh, DVD of the Dead. Check him out if you uh, haven't subbed to his channel as well. And uh, there's a few other people out there. You know, I'm not going to name drop everybody. You know. But uh, those are like two of the first guys that uh, I made friends with and I always watch their vids. YouTube Moses. Uh, always watch his vids and uh, he's always commenting and writing and stuff. So, But uh, just uh, thanks for all the support, guys. 40, uh, 40 subs is big deal to me so far because I didn't really start doing this to uh, get a whole bunch of subs or you know become a big deal on YouTube it's a hobby it's something for me to do and a way for me to connect with uh, other film fans and uh, that's all I'm really out for so uh, you know it's great whenever I get to hear from you guys and talk to you guys about movies and uh, talk to you about you know whatever's going on whatever flicks you like or whatever stuff you're getting into and uh, you know but uh I said thanks again, and uh, hopefully uh, keep the subs coming. I'm hoping, I know I said on one of my vids before uh, that uh, I was going to wait until I got 100 subs to uh, do a, a Q&A session, but what I might do is just, uh, if I get 10 more, if I get to 50, maybe I'll do uh, one Q&A session with, uh, you know, whoever wants to ask me any questions or anything like that, and uh then maybe once I get, you know, maybe every 50 subs I'll do a new Q&A and maybe answer new questions or if anybody has any new questions as new subscribers come along. But uh, I'm going to keep doing it. I'm going to keep making vids. And uh, as long as people are still watching and enjoying them, I'll keep making them. And uh, keep an eye out for a couple more that will be coming. I am going to review the uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Blu-ray box set. Do plan on reviewing that. Finally finish watching all those. And uh, I think my next vid tonight, I'm, I'm posting two vids tonight. I'm posting this one, and right after this, I'm going to do my uh, top five uh, favorite John Carpenter films. So, thanks again. Rate, sub, subscribe, or uh, rate, sub, and uh, comment. And uh, take it easy, man. See you later.